Let's go across to uh, Prashant, who also joins us live for more on this big story. Prashant, on one hand, while efforts are being made that there is some sort of a solution on this long pending issue, look what our Netas are doing. Sena MP says, ignore Supreme Court. BJP MP says, anti Ram is being anti national. Well, absolutely. Anything who is speaking against the government, anything who is speaking against the Hindu, any, anyone who is speaking against the entire issue of the Ram Temple is someone who is termed anti-national by a certain section of leaders. And we have the names now. We have Vinay Katiyar, we have Sanjay Raut. But clearly, the kind of statement that Sanjay Raut has given, it gives you a sense of how Shiv Sena wants BJP to be deviated and how Shiv Sena wants BJP to be disturbed because just the statement has just come, you know, weeks after Shiv Sena said that it will snap it, its alliance with the BJP come 2019. So this gives you a sense of what Shiv Sena is doing. But the kind of statement, the religious disharmony statement that Shiv Sena has given, that certainly does not go down well with people and perhaps with any political party because they're straight away attacking the judiciary, the highest, you know, highest court of law in our country. Okay, Prashant, stay with us. Let's now go across to Anisha who joins us live as well on this big story. Anisha, give us a sense of firstly what happened in the court. We know now this entire matter will be heard in the month of March. Well, yes, on the 14th of March, the Supreme Court is going to start the hearings in the title dispute of the Ram Janmabhoomi Babri Masjid case. We also know that the Supreme Court has made it clear that for now it will not be hearing any of the intervention applications that have been filed on the basis of sentiment and religion. It has made it very clear that it is only hearing the title dispute for now. Uh, I also have with me Mr. Uh, Sayed Vaseem Rizvi of the Shia Works Board. Sir, uh, the, the Supreme Court has today said that it will not allow any interventions for now and it will be hearing this entire matter. There are hundreds of documents that are going to be presented. How are we seeing this uh, development of this case now and what uh, stand does the Shia Works Board now have since the court is saying that it will only hear the main petition? The uh, main petitioners have said to listen to the title dispute. We are also a party of that. तो आ, हमने जो एसएलपी दाखिल की है हमने पार्टी बनने के लिए आ, कोई दरखास्त कोई वहां पे हमने नहीं कोर्ट में डाली है जो हमने अपील दाखिल की है वो जो एक मुकदमा शिया वक्फ बोर्ड हारा था उसके अगेंस्ट अपील दाखिल की वो एक अलग केस है और जो ये मेन लीडिंग केस है टाइटल डिस्प्यूट के उसमें एक पक्षकार हम भी हैं उस पक्षकार के नाते हमने अपनी बात रखी है कि ये प्रॉपर्टी जो है देखिए जब उसमें शिया भी पार्टी है सुन्नी भी पार्टी है शिया और सुन्नी जिस वक्त अब इस वक्त हमारे व्यूज अलग हैं उनके व्यूज अलग हैं वो कहते हैं कि ये मस्जिद यहां पर थी हम यही मस्जिद बनाएंगे शिया वक्फ बोर्ड का कहना ये है कि यहां पर मस्जिद थी लेकिन हम यहां मस्जिद नहीं बनाएंगे यहां से मस्जिद हम दूर हट के बनाएंगे ताकि यहां पर कोई विवाद ना पैदा हो खून खराबे की जगह पर हमें मस्जिद बनाने की जरूरत नहीं है जितना खून खराबा हो चुका है वो बहुत हो चुका अब इंसानी खून के ऊपर ये कोई इस्लाम में किसी तरह की कोई ऐसी मिसाल नहीं मिलती कि इस्लाम की कहीं जमीन पे खून के गारे से कोई इबादतगाह बनाई जाए सर एक जस्ट वन लास्ट क्वेश्चन दिस द the, there has been a proposal sent to the All India Muslim Personal Law Board by the Hindu side. There have been uh, certain proposals that have been sent with regard to how to shift and how to come to an out-of-court settlement. Do you see an out-of-court settlement happening even while the Supreme Court is hearing the matter? Look, out-of-court settlement can never be done. If the matter is Supreme Court, but if all parties have to take any settlement, which has no doubt about any other parties, which has no doubt about any हो तो वो किसी वक्त भी हो सकता है जजमेंट आने के वक्त तक हो सकता है कोर्ट उसको अप्रिशिएट कर सके करेगी बिल्कुल करेगी मुझे ये उम्मीद है कि अगर के सारी पार्टीज ये कह दें क्योंकि ये एक एक ये नेशनल इंटरेस्ट का मैटर है यहां पर ये ये ऐसा फैसला अगर हो गया कि सब एक मामला सेटल्ड हो गया तो एक इससे एक बहुत अच्छा मैसेज जाएगा लेकिन उस पे ये उस वक्त होगा जब दिलों में नफरतों को निकालकर दिल साफ करके बैठेंगे जी सो द कोर्ट इज नाउ गोइंग टू बी हियरिंग द मैटर ऑन मार्च 14th एंड वी विल सी व्हाट हैपेंस फर्दर बैक टू यू